Hello and welcome to episode 136 of Bobo Scrub Arty Records. Hey. So, last episode, I had a terrible time in the bat chat. Both times we went out in it. Both times we did next to no damage. What a pain in the bottom. Bottom, bottom, bottom. So, I'm going to change things up a little bit. And I'm going to pop out Super Pershing because it's had its HD render done. Ooh, looks lovely. Ooh. And I've had this the longest time. It was my first ever premium tank. And I've always liked it. I know people haven't haven't liked it, but I've liked it. The gun's not too great, but yeah, you know. So, and we need some money for the S51 because we're still not quite there. We're not able to buy the gun and all the ammunition for it. So if we can get enough money together this episode, we'll go out there. And if not, we'll have to wait until next time. But we'll pop out the Super Pershing and see if we can make some money. And then we'll do some more artillery. So yeah, mm. a medium tank in artillery uh, episodes. Ooh. What the deuce? Oh, hidden village. Hmm. It's interesting. Yes. Okay. Hmm. There are the teams. Lots of medium tanks again. But no artillery, you notice. I've got a funny feeling that because of how often I go out in artillery, that this happens a lot, is that when I go out in a medium tank, because I do like playing medium tanks, um, there aren't any artillery in like the first one or two matches that I play. It's a bit weird. So, looks like we've got some decent support. This is a tier 8 game. And I found that with the Super Pershing, because the gun's not too great, and we do have some serious weak points, that it can be handy sometimes to be able to keep people at range. Hmm. Does he pop down? Yes, he has. Okay. Yeah, it's easier to keep people at range so they can't hit your weak spots. Um, and the gun's not too bad, to be honest. I do have eight premium rounds, just in case things get a little bit hairy. He's spotting a decent amount over here, and I don't like it. Can we get a shot on him? Ugh. Not like that, we can't. Okay, still nothing spotted over this way. Uh, we'll be lucky. He's in a very good spot, though. Thought I'd risk it. Okay. People aren't really wanting to push around here. This is odd. You'd think that they would. Let's see if we can get another shot on him, then. We can't. Okay, there's an FCM, <laughs> the old pick and place machine. It's a trap! Let's just stick here for a second. Right here then, let's try and be aggressive. We've got lots of people behind us. I'm um, probably not going to be as good as talking. Good at talking with them. Um... It's a trap! Whoop. Can we get the cheeks on this thing? I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah I think we can. Okay. There's the FCM. Oh, where did that where did that shell go? Oh. Come on, reload. <laughs> okay. Rightio, so there's type 59 pushing there. Ah, T44. See if we can get round on one of these guys then. Nice, we've got the Pershing. Get another shot on this guy, possibly. It's a trap! 
Come on. No. Okay, this is not cool. Let's see if we can get shot before these guys flank us. It's a nice, we did. Okay, so we're about to get flanked. Mm. Okay, he missed us at least. <laughs> yeah, let's see if we can get around on this guy. Okay, we need to fix the ammo storage, that's not good. Ah, and now we can't fix the track. So this is always good. And he knows exactly where our weak spots are. Don't really like face hugging these tanks, but never mind. Okay. We're slowly whittling him down. Okay. Excellent stuff. We've managed to get him. Right, so let's get move around on this Type 59. We're on very low HP. Uh, that is the disadvantage with us having a low ping. Um, I find that sometimes, like, I was pretty damn sure that I pressed fire before we blew up. But, yeah, it's the unfortunate thing with me being across the water. That was a good game. Um, we managed to take out a couple. Or one at least and uh, yeah that was unfortunate I don't know why maybe we could have been a little bit more aggressive on the uh, the FCM and tried to finish him off first but uh, hmm yeah it's unlucky okie dokie so as you saw that was a defeat we got a third class mastery badge though which is not too bad and oh top of the table look not bad on XP Managed to get over 2,000 damage at least. So that's something. It's not bad for a tier 8. And we made 54k even though we got blown up. So yeah. And that was a that was just a standard XP as well. Hmm. Interesting. Okie dokie. Well, going to try one more then. Because I can get some good credits with the T54. So I'll pop out in this as well. And then hopefully we'll have enough credits to be able to top up the, uh, the S51. Himmelsdorf. The winter Himmelsdorf. Mm. Okay. There are the teams. Got some nice big artillery on this map. Be interesting. Okay, I'm willing to go for the hill. Just because of the lack of heavy tanks. We could try and push the western flank, but we'll wait and see what pops up, what's, see what's occurring. Hopefully we won't get too bogged down on the hill, so if we need to get back, we can. I don't really want to push him, I want to get round him. <laughs> okay. So we've got a few people heading towards the hill here, which is good. The Ag Tiger could do with a hand. Possibly. T54 Lightweight's being very aggressive. And the 263 as well. Wow, blimey. Okay, so we might. We might end up having to head back. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, let's wait and see what this pattern spots. There's an AMX 30. Cool, we managed it's to pass a shot off of him. Which is nice. Gonna have to be careful headed round this way because of the artillery. Let's see if we can get a shot off anyway. It's a trap! Cool, he's firing um Hesh. Let's 
Let's pop back round and see if someone can give us some support. I'm not going to use a repair kit here. Uh, I didn't realise this. Uh... Alright, we're going to need to use a repair kit there. Cool, we tracked him. Ah, oh, de ah, oh, really? He just just got in the way there, and we couldn't back up in time. Ish, god damn. Okie dokie. Well, that turned out into a victory in the end. They managed to pull through. It was really, really good. Uh, we only managed one thousand one hundred eighty damage, but I think that's because we got kind of caught up with people there. And for, to, uh, well, that helps, doesn't it, for our uh, getting money together for the S fifty one. But let's um, let's check it out. See if we do have enough. Do we have enough to buy it? That's good. And the old gun was one fifty two br two. So if we sell that, one fifty two br two, sell that. It's good because we don't need it anymore. And we'll get some shells together. So best load a couple of those in. All right. We'll do that then, I think. Yeah, so we haven't got enough money, unfortunately, to get the um, rammer or the gun laying drive yet. We're going to need a hell of a lot more credits for that but i'm willing to give it a go as it is you guys have uh, told me it's great so let's go out and try it as is without any equipment other than a camo net <laughs> and a new crew so yeah wish us luck hmm karelia ah oh, how we love karelia hey so mm, there are the teams and we're starting over this side so as you see, I said about this is the first game with no equipment or anything, and we get a cancer comment. Ah, uh, cancer. I'm guessing that some of these people have never had family members or things with cancer, but I don't mind people using terms such as scumbag and things like that, you know, people can hate and whatever but using the term cancer I mean that's just that's that's not cricket but enough said about that bloody negative people I don't know right this crummy's in a good position and we do have possibility to get someone here okay this is difficult, he's in a good spot. Let's see if he pushes forward a little bit more. Come on, little man. Target fixation here, but no mind. Alright, we're not going to get him from where we are. There's a KV-2, though. Just sat out in the open. Wow, the same time without the... Uh, without the gun laying, driving things. Okay, I'm not going to get any spots on them anymore. Have a look at these heavies, then. See what we can manage. We've lost some good people right at the beginning. Doesn't help. Okay. Try and get aimed in on this T29. Shots away. Ooh, blimey. That was a big old splash. Awesome stuff. ITO then. So we've got someone here. And some people there. There's a tog all the way over on the other side too. Mm -hmm. Right, got quite a long reload. So can't get anything on the tiger there. Possibly going to have to move soon. This tiger P is just going to be surrounded if we're unlucky. So this side's been dropped off so you can come up from this angle. This is interesting. Might need to find some new spots then. 
to sit because obviously I've just sat in a spot that we know we know as being a good one. Hmm, we've got people camping at the back. I suppose they're gonna spot if people do come up. Do pop up the middle of the map at all. So there is that at least. Is that guy backing off to come around this way? So we could get a shot on him if he comes over this way. Oh, I wish these guys camping would move on up. And 12's got another one. And Tiger One's got another one. So there's the Dickamax. He's sat fairly out in the open. Let's see if we can get a shot on him then. Uh, aim time. Shots away. Cool, we did splash him. There's the, t the uh, KV2. Ooh, we've got a hell of a long reload. To wait and see, won't we? So we'll stick here then. Stick here and see. He might pop up again. That Hellcat's pushing on in, but hopefully he won't be too keen to push too far. Let's see if this KV2 pops up again. He might pop up when he fires, if nothing else. 52 second reload though, that's crazy craziness. Yeah, the rabbit's drinking again. <laughs> okay, so has the KV2 decided to push or not? This is the question. People are moving around. Right, T15A's coming back. It's going to be a while before he spots anything though. There's the TOG. Okay. Let's try and get aimed in on the TOG then. <laughs> All right, so we've lost sight of the TOG. Let's get back in over where this, uh, this KV-2 possibly is. Okay, gonna need to move the hull a lot. Hopefully we've moved it enough to get aimed in in time. Oh dear, right on the edge of our traverse. Let's take a shot anyway. Excellent stuff. Okie dokie. So the TOG's big and slow. Let's see if we can get aimed in on this 87. <laughs> Alright, still reloading. seconds and he's gone <laughs> All right and we didn't need to get uh, didn't need to get aimed in at all so we've managed to take him out so now let's keep an eye out for the tog tog's going to come down this way he's very slow but he should have made his way over here by now yes excellent stuff too far away to get spotted for the time being, so let's try and get a shot on the TOG. And boop. And that went long. Excellent stuff. Rightio. Wait for a minute then. We'll back up a little bit. So now we wait for this reload time. Hopefully the ATT-15 a can hold off these guys. Mm, another 20 seconds to go. <laughs> oh, getting there. Okay, so we should finish off the tog. That's good. See if we can get a shot on this guy. Oh dear. Okay. Cool, we splashed him at least. Let's see if these guys can finish him off while he's tracked. We'll get a little bit more of assist damage. Oh, unfortunately not. Looks like he's got his tracks back up again. 
Excellent stuff. So we can move forward again. So there's just the Dickamax left. And then... The two artillery. So this is where the Dickamax was last spotted. I expect he would have moved by now. Hopefully he would have pushed around this way. There's the M12, that's interesting. Righty, oh, we'll let our aim time come in. Oh, so slow. So very slow. Hmm. Excellent. That's that guy gone. Move on a little bit more. Hopefully, Dickamax hasn't pushed up the middle. Oh, he has. Yes, indeed. Someone call him a ambulance. I don't know if this thing's much good at shotgunning. But we'll try. I think the Crusader's done for. Can we get a shot on him? Possibly. And we haven't needed to, because he's uh, been shotgunned. Lovely. Okie dokie. Well, that was a victory. And first game, we managed a second-class mastery badge. It's not too bad at all. We had a couple of shots go a bit wonky there, but never mind. And we managed 2,500 damage, almost. So, you know, that's not too bad. And I don't know what this guy was moaning about. He did very well, which is cool. So the amount of shots he took was insane. And we got a decent amount of XP, so that shot our uh, our people up from 0 to 20% pretty much straight away, which is lovely jubbly. And all we did... Oh yeah, we didn't auto-supply the ammunition. So we managed 36 grand there. It's not too bad. I suppose we best, um, best resupply on those, hey? Yes. Excellent. Okie dokie. So, yeah. I think without the rammer and stuff, we'll, we'll carry on using it. Um, we can't have vents, unfortunately. But, um, yeah, I think what we'll do is we'll go for the, um, the gun laying drive first for the aiming speed. Or maybe we should go for the reload time. At 52 seconds, probably worth going for the reload time. Yeah. So I expect we'll go for that next when we get the cash together. So, yeah. Okie dokie. Well, we'll leave it there for this episode. Thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed. It really helps me out and helps the channel and stuff. So that's really cool. And until next time. Bye.